Whether you're just getting started with engraving or you're looking to upgrade your setup, choosing the right engraver can make all the difference. Best Built offers powerful laser options with thoughtful accessories, starting with the anti-curling jig, the auto-tilting rotary clamp, a tilting holder, a pendant clamp, and lastly, the honeycomb cutting panel. We'll be going through a flat engraving. This is Best Built's Magic Art 7 laser software. First thing is to make sure that the unit is connected. Next, we'll import the image to start the design. Now that the design is loaded into the software, we're going to refresh our integrated camera to view it on the actual piece itself. We're going to do some slight adjustments, starting with the dimension. Now that it's the right size, we're going to add some hatching to it to tell the laser how we want to engrave this piece. Now that the hatching is applied, we can go in and see the actual lines of the direction that the laser will be going to engrave this image. Now that we have it hatched and placed, we can now go in and preview it on the laser itself to make sure that the design lines up on the piece. The laser projects a bounding box surrounding the area the design will be engraved. Now that we have confirmation it's in the right spot, we can now go to start the engraving. We're gonna pick our yellow gold settings, ensure that we have the right settings and proceed to engrave. This is a standard warning that shows before you engrave. I'll click start. This is a cleaning pass to apply the finish we selected to the engraving. And just like that, our engraving is complete. Let's engrave a ring. I'll use the ring engraving attachment. Insert the ring and tighten the chuck to hold it in place. This is Best Built's Magic Art 7 laser engraver software. First, we want to make sure that the unit is connected to the software. We'll ensure that we pick the ring, action, and insert the correct dimensions for the ring. Next, we'll add a little bit of text to the ring for the design. With that text inserted, we want to make sure that we place it where we want it to engrave on the ring. I'm going to make the text exactly 3 millimeters tall. That changes the size, so I'll recenter it. Next, we'll apply some hatching. With the hatching applied, you can clearly see how the engraving is going to work. Now we can preview it to see where it's actually going to fall on the ring itself. I'll make a few adjustments to line everything up. Now that we confirm that it falls on the right spot on the ring, we can now proceed with the actual engraving. We want to make sure to pick the yellow gold engraving style and now start the engraving. That's how you complete an inside ring engraving using Best Built's Magic Art 7 laser software. We'll be reviewing these engravings using the Gimax Pro 2 digital microscope. This has a 20 times magnification. This is a close up of Best Built's flat engraving. This engraving did have an integrated cleaning pass. Notice the strong edges and no visible hatching marks. This is a close up of Best Built's ring engraving. 
We could read the engraving clearly with no visible hatching marks. The engraving closely matches the design with minimal deviation and with the cleaning pass. At the end of the day, the best engraver really comes down to your needs. No matter what you're engraving, rings, pendants, or personalized gifts, there's a machine here that can help you do it precisely, faster, and with more confidence. So think about what fits your workflow, your skill level, and your goals, and let that guide your decision.